boys and girls. Eh, but, but. <laughs> well, that was another tough day at work, said Fireman Sam. Let's get this all closed up and head on home for a nice cup of tea. But just as he was closing it up, he turned around and saw Naughty Norman peeking round the corner. Norman, what are you doing peeping round the back of Jupiter? Well, Fireman Sam, I've got a favour to ask. I've ordered these really cool eggs off of eBay and, well, they're too big to be delivered. They're too big to be delivered, said Fireman Sam. That doesn't make any sense. How can they be too big? Well, um, I'll show you. Stand back, Fireman Sam. I'll show you what I mean. And sure enough, three huge eggs rolled right out in front of his truck. Wow, I can see exactly what you mean, Norman. I've got an idea. I can help you deliver these to your post office. Run back home and I'll be there in no time. Gee, thanks, Sam. See you in a sec. Naughty Norman ran all the way back home and waited patiently at the post office for the eggs to be delivered by Fireman Sam. Deliver eggs? Deliver eggs, said Fireman Sam. They're going to laugh about it when I tell them this at the station. If there's one thing they don't teach you when you're trained to be a fireman, it's how to deliver eggs. How am I going to do this? Whoa there! With a huff and a puff and a bit of a struggle, he managed to get the Kinder Surprise egg into the back. Fireman Sam climbed into Jupiter and thought, We'll just take it nice and slow, nice and slow. It's not that far to the post office. But he hit some rubbish. <laughs> and the egg tumbled and fell off. Oh no. Oh no, Norman will be cross, said Fireman Sam. Oh, what do we do? Well, the egg said that it has a surprise. Maybe we should open it, boys and girls. What do you think? Should we open it? Well, I wonder what the surprise could be. Let's open it and find out. Fire and Sam knelt down to remove some of the rubbish from the road and thought, right, we'll try the next egg. That'll get there in one piece for sure. With the next egg loaded, Fireman Sam was sure that he would make it all in one piece. But no, there was some rubbish in the road again, and the egg fell over. Okay, let's get busy. I just don't know what's going wrong today, thought Fireman Sam. This egg smashed too. Well, oh, we better check what's inside this one. Well, look at that, thought Fireman Sam. It's a dragon kite. Wow, Norman's going to love this. He cleared away the rubbish in the road again and thought, I've got one more egg. I can get it there in one piece for sure. And he loaded up Jupiter once more. Here we go. He also had the kite, the motorbike and the massive egg on the back. Come on, he thought, we can make it. And he pulled up right in front of the post office. Hello, Norman. This has been quite a journey. I'm in Sam. What happened to my other eggs? I'm terribly sorry, Norman. This has been quite a project. I mean, I have actually just smashed with the eggs. I'm so sorry. But I have built you two toys, which I hope you will love. 
Ta -da! And he unloaded the dragon kite and the toy motorbike. Wow, thanks Sam, that's so cool. But what's in the other egg? I don't know, said Sam. Shall we find out together? We sure should. Let's go. Simon and Sam, two giant spinning tops. Shall we have a race? Yes, Sam. On your marks, get set, go. First one to win gets a ride in Jupiter. Three, two, one, spin! Well, there, I think I've won. Look at that. Well, you be getting on home now, Norman. And I'll see you again when you order some more eggs. Bye for now. Ready, Fireman Sam? I'll show you what I mean. Whoa, what was that? 